What's what's going on, my fellow collectors? I am back with another unboxing. Oh gosh, love doing these unboxings. It's a small little tiny package today. Uh, as you can see, I have my little scene going on with the helpless human being guy right here. Look like he's about to be attacked. Well, he is being attacked, not about to be attacked by the grid head alien, a face hugger. And he looks like he's about to be down for his count, guys, as you can see. Gotta love the alien figures. Very highly articulated, as you can see. Yep, yes, they are. But you have to be extremely careful because these are like, I think, the second wave of the alien figures from AVP movie. And uh, the joints are very fragile, as you can see. Very, very thin, tight joints in there all the way. So if you do have these guys, be careful. Because uh, I am a person that can uh, verify that they're very fragile. This guy was broken when I first got him way back. But uh, that's a whole other story. But today I have a unboxing. Look at the small little package. It's so small, guys. This is from a Hong Kong seller, as you can see. Yep. So about to open this bad boy up. As you can see, it's securely wrapped up. Very, very tight. So let me just sit my camera down right here. My iPhone camera on the glass table. While I start uh Trying to rip this bad boy open from right here. Let's see. Alright. Do I can get this open right here with my scissors? Trusty scissors. So uh yeah guys, Hot Toys is trying to be doing it again. Got a lot of figures coming out. A lot of figures. What you guys gonna do? We stay on the board. We got the Avenger figures coming. Uh, we got the Metal Gear Solid figures that's on the way. Uh, we got the uh, Avatar figure that just got released. Oh my gosh. Joker DX. So many figures. What to do. What to do. Then we got 3A figures that's coming our way. And that's on out for pre-order. Me, myself, personally, I'm trying to cut back, so I won't be able to get everything, guys. I would like to get that Avatar figure. It is a cool figure, but uh, it's not a must-have. I got to really think and be straight up. Okay, guys, as you can see, we got the styrofoam right there to protect. So the seller packed it pretty well. Make sure anything doesn't get damaged in there. Um, I think I got this from a seller called Storerooms on eBay. The name is Storerooms, so packaging pretty well. And uh, here's actually the little slip right here. I don't see the name though. I'm trying to look and see what the name is right here. Yeah, there we go. Storerooms right there, as you can see. So took about oh, about three weeks and some time for this stuff to come so you have to be prepared when you're ordering from a eBay seller from Hong Kong that it may take forever you know sometimes it's not like that but the majority of the time it is but uh I tell you eBay does pay guys because what I'm about to show you guys actually retail for uh, I would say about a 60 bucks shipped so I got it for half that price that's one thing about eBay when people aren't bidding on other stuff you can get lucky on a good deal <laughs> and I was the only one that bid it on this little this set right here it's nothing major like I said small I told you guys I'm getting into my doing one six customs and you know just making things other than buying hot toys in one six scale so uh, this is an accessory set, and let's check it out, see what it is. Can you guys see? Can you guys see? Turn this camera around a bit. Bang, baby! Bang, look at that! Is that a chest buster? Can you see the chest buster, guys? 
Got three of them. Here we go, right here. Got three of these bad boys. Let me give you a better view. Let me see if I can lift the camera a bit without covering up the microphone because you know how I usually do. <laughs> but yeah, these are three chest busters. Then we have uh, the weapons. And this is from a set called the Alien Killer Set. And this is the version 3 set. There was a two other versions that came out. This is the, the uh, third installment. The first version, I think, was a Gatling gun with a backpack and a uniform and three of these chest busters right here. I'm surprised they don't have like, no type of actual packaging, you know, that kind of, you know, states what it is. Everything is just individual. So I guess the seller actually gets pieces and they put the pieces together, I guess, and just sell them like that. But um, it's okay. I don't mind. Like I said, I got these bad boys on a fair deal half price actually and I've been eyeing them for like forever so it does pay to keep watching and and just be patient on eBay open this up right here so you see what this stuff is oh okay not really exactly sure what this was on the movie aliens but uh I think it's some type of uh you know tracking device so that the you know, the uh, Marines was able to track the aliens. Looks like you kind of hold it probably like this with the handle right there. And maybe type in whatever type of codes or frequencies you need to put in. But it's pretty weathered nicely. I don't know if you guys can really see the weathering on this bad boy. Turn this thing around right here. Alrighty. And uh, it looks like that's like a the screen. So they can see. So if they're holding it like this by their hand, they can look at the screen while they're looking above over top of it. Little wire right there. Pretty cool. Alrighty. <clears throat> see what this is wrapped up right here. So this actually looks like the flamethrower that was in the movie. Oops. That fell off right there. I guess you can switch it up. Either put this canister piece. Don't know what the, the meaning of two different type of canisters is for. That don't even fit. Maybe you could take this off right here. Uh, don't know yet. I don't want to break anything. But for now, as you can see, you just put this right there. And uh, you have your blowtorch. I do remember this in the movie, the Aliens movie. It has a strap, a harness and everything. Looks pretty cool. And uh, I guess this can come off right here. Put it back on. Cool, cool, cool. Minor weathering, but an army type of green color. So that's pretty cool. Alrighty. Oh, I guess you put this at the bottom right here. Here we go. There we go. That's how it goes, as you can see. And I guess all of this is the fuel for the, the flamethrower, like the, the clip. So you don't have to use a backpack anymore. You know, I guess typical flamethrowers actually have some type of backpack to go with them. But this is just all like one big thing right here. So that's cool. Alrighty, here we have that. We got this other small packaging right here. That's red. See what this is. Okay, cool. Looks like another type of tracking device. So I guess one of them you may have a heat, and then the other one you may have like a just a radar type sensor. So this and it actually wow, that's cool. That's why you gotta love one six. Little tiny small moving parts, always a plus. And actually have like a little strapping, just in case if you want to connect it to some type of little area on the figure. So it's pretty cool. And last but not least, let me just rip that up right there. This looks like the post rifle. It's pretty 
you pretty cool, pretty cool guys. Minor weathering around the, the handle areas you can see. I wonder if the stock moves back. Yes, it does. Stock moves back. Cool. Nice design. Very, very nice. wonder if the clip clip should come out. Should come out. Just probably a little stuck. Yes, it does. As you can see, clip comes out. Fine details. Again, like I said, this is the Alien Killer set. The third version. I actually have another one coming uh, that I got on another deal. $30, the same type deal. So I got the same exact set. Gonna make some, some, uh, you know, some troopers to go with these weapons and everything. And they're gonna hunt some aliens. So I would recommend this little set for anyone that has the alien figures. I know at one time a while back, SciShow actually had an exclusive of the, uh, what was it? The the wolf predator and it came with a chest buster so some people was just like spending tons of money just to get that chest buster from them so this is pretty cool actually got one three of them actually now finally look like they'll be good for you know if you want to do some type stop motion or whatever the case may be they're wired inside there as you can see so that's pretty awesome so just something real fast, just wanted to do a little show and tell on the two to the fellow collectors out there. Thanks for watching this video, guys. Uh, keep watching, more to come. Alrighty. Moogie. Moogie215 is on and out. Peace.